Hi, welcome to Awesome in 5 Minutes. Guess who is our guest today? Hard singing when you were on the magic carpet? The carpet? No, but the carpet is um, the carpet is super fun, actually. Oh, really? The carpet feels like it's, it's, the, it's the smoothest ride you'll ever have. You know, it's like, it feels like a ride. So guess who I have right now? I have Telly Leong, Hi. the actor for Aladdin. <laughs> I am so honored. May I ask if, like, did you start when you were a small child? You know, I actually did not. I, um, I did not have stage parents at all uh -huh. that started me young. You know, I, a theater was something that I found, uh, you know, during high school. Actually, I, I went to a math and science high school in New York City called Stuyvesant High School. Oh, okay. And I, you know, and, and to get my to give myself a little break from the calculus and the physics and the chemistry, I which was I, scary. A, yeah. Well, it's fine. It's cool, <laughs> you know. But it was using one side of my brain. I wasn't very creative. Mm -hmm. I decided to do a lot of theater as a hobby. And, okay. Um, so it was, you know, I, the first musical I ever did was Pippin, at Stuyvesant High School. Um, and did uh, you um, audition? I did. I it was my very, it was the first time I auditioned for a musical. You know, it was uh, it was it was a great experience, and that's when I kind of fell in love with with doing theater. You know, really at the time, you know mm -hmm. what I what I kind of loved about it, and what I still love about it. What I think is the reason why I'm still doing theater as a profession is that it was it was um, I was surrounded by people that I felt like was my tribe. You know, oh. like I felt like I was surrounded by this very it. special community. Of I people, see. of artists that all love the same thing. And yes, we all liked performing and we liked doing the show, but really I, I liked hanging out with those people. You know, it was my social circle. And I feel, I feel that's very similar now. Now that I'm in the Broadway community, it's this wonderful, beautiful community of people that I've considered kind of my extended family, especially the Asian performing community. You know, the Asian American performers oh. are, um, are a tight knit little family too in, in the Broadway community. So, Aladdin is a. Uh to stereotypically Middle Eastern, and you are definitely Asian American. Yeah. So how does that make you feel? Well, it's interesting. You know, the Aladdin is um, this this story has existed for thousands and thousands of years. You yes. know, in many cultures, mm -hmm. and you know, it's interesting. Most people, a lot of people, think that it's actually from Scheherazade's A Thousand and One Arabian Nights, when actually it isn't. No. The original translator, Galland, was uh, had actually it was a uh, it was a story that he had heard, mm -hmm. and the story actually originally took place in China. Aladdin was a little Chinese was a Chinese boy. You know, so um, it's interesting, like the origins of the story are, are sort of, you know, blurry as mm -hmm. far as like where it is from. Um, of course, with Disney, they decided to do a very Middle Eastern treatment of it in the, mm -hmm. in, the, in the film. But, you know, when it's on Broadway, you know, w what I love about it is that we have such an ethnically diverse cast on this stage. You yeah, know, I see our that. Agrabah here in the Broadway production is Agrabah is a fantastic place. Agrabah doesn't exist. So in the world, in our world of Agraba, it's people of all different races. You know, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Aladdin tonight happens to be Chinese American. You know, a Jasmine <laughs> made the amazing Courtney Reed happens to be half Vietnamese and half Caucasian. Oh. The genie happens to be Afri African African American, and and the rest of our company is this kind of diverse, wonderful company of people. Um, and you know, I think that's that's kind of the power of of theater too, right? Mm -hmm. Is that in in our world in this theater, you know. An audience comes and they sit in these seats and they sit in this beautiful, beautiful theater mm -hmm. and they suspend their disbelief. Art crosses borders, are you saying? Well, I definitely think that, you know, I definitely think that art expands minds and yes. art, makes, art makes, you know, on the stage anything is possible, you know. And, um, and, these, and, and the possibilities of these characters is infinite. So, I, for me, I feel like that's what's really, really special about this company of Aladdin. It's diversity. Is this your dream role, Telly? Oh gosh, you know that's a that's a, such a tough question to answer. Uh -huh. You know, I definitely have a special place in my heart for this role because I, you know, like every kid, I grew up on this movie and I fell in love with this character from the animated film. So, yeah. you know, is there a, a little part of me, the little boy Telly, that's like, oh my gosh, I get to play Aladdin? Of course, I'm so so excited <laughs> it's to do that. a fulfillment. Yeah, it's such a wonderful, it's such a wonderful, you know, dream of mine. But you know, I, I remember doing Rent on Broadway. Yes, I saw you. And that was such a dream to be able to do that too because Rent was the show that I saw when I was 16 years old that made me want to do this, you mm -hmm. know. I remember being in high school and seeing the original company of Rent and being like, wow, I, w I think I can do that one day, you know. And then, of course, I, I, you know, another dream of mine was to originate a Broadway role and create a character. And I got to do that, you know, la a couple of years ago doing Allegiance with Leia Salonga. Yes. And getting to originate the role of Sam with her playing Kay, my sister. And so, mm -hmm. you know, that's also a wonderful dream. So is Aladdin the only dream role? Like, I don't, I don't, I don't know if I can answer that, you know, uh -huh. but, but it's definitely been, you know, little 12-year-old Telly is really excited he's playing Aladdin. Thank you so much for this magical interview, Telly. And uh, more power to you.
See you next week, ladies and gentlemen. Bye!